In a continued effort to make the new features in Autodesk Power Mill 2020 beneficial to all users, the use of multi-threading has been enabled for leads and links calculation, resulting in significant increases in performance when generating connection moves. This means that when a leads and links calculation is instigated, PowerMill will spread the calculation across multiple CPU cores if available on your PC hardware. In this example, we have just created a steep and shallow semi-finishing toolpath on this die, which measures approximately 1,400 millimeters by 396 millimeters by 274 millimeters in X, Y, and Z respectively. By default, PowerMill will inherit the leads and links set by the previously active toolpath. And since they were not modified prior to the calculation of the toolpath, we have inherited the ramp moves from the previous roughing operation. This is not ideal, so the leads and links need to be edited. Fortunately, with PowerMill, we have the luxury of being able to calculate the leads and links independently without having to recalculate the whole toolpath. So in this instance, we will open up the Toolpath Connections form from the Toolpath Edit tab and simply change the lead in to be a surface normal arc of 90 degrees and with a five millimeter radius and we'll copy that to the lead out. We will also set the link moves to be skim to minimize the rapid moves in the safe plane to speed up machining time. Now from a user perspective, you will actually see no change in terms of the interaction with this. So in order to see the multi-threading in action, we will raise the task manager so that we may observe the CPU usage reaching 100% utilization. As soon as we hit the apply button, CPU usage increases up to 100% and the leads and links are rapidly calculated using multi-threading. But in order to see the true benefit of this improvement, we're going to have to replay it, only this time as a side-by-side -side comparison with PowerMill 2019. On the left, we have PowerMill 2019. On the right is PowerMill 2020. Again, we have set the lead in to be a surface normal arc of 90 degrees and with a five millimeter radius, copy to the lead out and with the link move set to skim. By simultaneously hitting the apply buttons in both versions, we can see the difference. Note not only the significant 10 second difference in overall time to calculate the leads and links, which in this case equates to a 59% reduction in time, but also the fact that the CPU utilization runs at a much lower percentage in PowerMill 2019 than that of PowerMill 2020. This reduction in calculation time also means you have more freedom to iterate and explore alternative options, safe in the knowledge that each iteration will take considerably less time. By multi-threading leads and links in PowerMill 2020, the overall time to calculate a toolpath is reduced, allowing you to get your parts on your machine sooner.